Hootenanny! I can't believe I forgot this. Did you see Jules Holland's Hootenanny? I can't hear you all shouting. What's going on? Did you watch it? That's probably the worst I've ever seen, and it's a show I like. Now, I've only seen it a couple of days ago. I was late to the party. I recorded it. I've been busy. Couple of good singers on there. The young Irish girl, very, very good. Couldn't understand the last half of, of the, the main line, what she said. But very good. Cracking voice. I think a British singer, long dark hair, very, very good. And I think another British singer, short dark hair, brilliant. Absolutely sensational. Really liked her. Didn't know who she was. A lot of you will. I'm not up, I'm not down with the kids. Not up with the kids. Down with the kids. I see on Tuesday night she had a bit of a concert there on BBC. Filmed, I think, at the Albert Hall. I've only noticed it today. I missed that, so maybe I'll go back to that and have a look at it. Thought she was sensational. Um, the woman, she was in green. She let her chest flow a little bit. I think she had no bra on, a bit braless. Either that or it was very, very cold in there. Uh, she was fantastic. Um, reminded me a bit of Amy Winehouse in a way, though didn't sound like her. Very, very good. But I still thought it was a poor show. And the poorest of the lot, I, I, I can't believe I'm, I'll let this go. Rod, again. What's going on? Now, I'm not going to say the old, who dressed him like he always do. I'm not going to say that. Mind you, I'd, I'd like to know. But... Oh, he was woeful. He's doing things again. I don't know if it's the song book this time or something else. He's doing not his own songs. He's do, I don't know what he's doing. He's doing songs. I know it's, uh, is it Skiffle or something? I know he's going to do an LP soon. An LP? Did they make them anymore? With Jules himself. But, oh, it was woeful. The first song he did, absolutely shocking. He did about three more, not much better, but not very good. I thought, I'm not going to be buying it. I'll tell you what, I think he sold us a pup. I think he's, well, he's definitely just trading on past reputations. Oh, and he did some dancing. He did a bit of cliff dancing. Cliff would have been happy with someone else dancing. Oh, that was bad as well. I've got no good say about him at all. I thought to myself halfway through his second song, I thought, do you know what? If I'm in a karaoke bar and he's singing that song, I'm going to look up think, who's that? Oh, right. And then just carry on talking. I mean, they're all going mad for him. I'll applaud him because he's Sir Rod Stewart. But I'm sure most of them thought, this is crap. It was absolutely woeful. And then, is it Paul Jones? Was it from Man for a Man? He did Pretty Flamingo and another one, Do I uh, Did He or something like that. Maybe it weren't that. And I thought, weren't great. So, good old song and whatever else. I mean, 60 years old, I couldn't believe that. The song, not him, he's about 80. The song was about 60 years old, or it is next, this year, I think he said. But I thought, I'll have to listen to that on YouTube, see if it sounds anything like it sounded tonight because I thought I'm sure that is singing's way out and it was way out compared to what it used to be but then on the second song I think it was he took the old mouth organ out did they call it her harmonica did that with it halfway through the song no one expected it and I think no one wanted it and when they heard it they thought oh my god they all clapped again but I thought that was terrible it just never went with the song at all it just never went with it and it was about 40 seconds long and you kept thinking end it now end it now end it now and then finally put it back in his skyrocket and it ended and he carried on singing and I thought, that was awful. So, bad. Paul Jones, bad. Pretty bad. Singing, not great. Harmonica, mouth organ, what are you going to call it? Pretty poor. Rod Stewart, woeful. Woeful. But as I say, I'm not going to say you dressed him. I'm not going to say that because I always say that, but I would like to know. Answers on a postcard. He was terrible, Rod.